What's going on guys? Matt Manduke here and today is my first day on the job. I don't know when you're going to see this but the fact is I'm done with training and now I'm in my own truck. I know I did promise a tour of this truck and I did mean to do it before I modified it but because of the parking spot I didn't have the room to fly the drone like I wanted to because I wanted to do it all around on the drone and I didn't have really the time to do it before I modified it because I had to put my stuff together and then I was uh well doing this. Now, now what I do have is a 2016 Freightliner Cascadia. You can see that I already moved my stuff in there and while my jacket is on the bed I did put something on the bed and I have my bunk folded up because I'm not using that anyway. Uh, I still have some other stuff I want to do in here. All I really did was move in. Move all my stuff in. I did go to Walmart and I got some things including food but I, I got some things that I kind of needed in here which uh, was the, the whole sleeping situation. I did put a memory foam uh, mattress cover on. I got some more pillows. Did some things. Now I am on a break now because I'm 15 minutes away from my pickup lo location and I'm not allowed to be there until 10 o'clock and it's now like 8 30. Yay. And it's starting to slow, snow. I'm sitting here in Ohio. But before beach bodies, bros better bundle up in boots, blankets, and balaclavas because a bloody bitter breeze will blow brisk, blustery, and bleak. And it was just a place where I can take my break. But yeah, so I'm going to pick that up and I got to take it back to Indianapolis. And it won't be snowing in Indianapolis when I get there, thank God, because there is a winter storm harbor. Correct and common to cocoon in a cap coat and comforter because a cut and cold can consume your character, occasionally create a corpse, and continually compress your cock. Is on the way. You know, I don't really want to get stranded in Ohio. I don't really want to get stranded in Indy either, but it might happen. Uh, but yeah, so I got this truck. I'm not going to have this. This truck for very long so i'm not doing any like major modifications not that i'm allowed to do major modifications but i'm not going to put a cb in if i get an inverter which i do intend on getting at least a 300 watt inverter so i can edit this video and edit the videos that i'm making as i go if i get an inverter it's only going to be a 300 watt because that's all i can plug in here hopefully when they move me out of this truck they'll give me at least a 2019 although i'd like a 2020 but i doubt it will be because i'm only going to have this truck for about a month or two depending on miles because it's got like 17,000 miles before it's out of warranty so then i'll be swapping out and i'm not trying to go overboard with the things that i'm doing before i you know move out of this truck because i'm only going to have it for a month and a half so what i'm doing with this truck is focusing on how to do the job oh i, I like money and i'm learning a lot at the crash course and it is what it is because i didn't train on over the road going over the road and learning how to do it is well it, it is what it is but i'm figuring it out and it's working so far i've done one delivery that i'm all working on my second one now all is going well i had to take a break so i pulled over here because i didn't have time to find somewhere else now I, and then i realized that i'm 15 minutes away from my destination with an hour and a half to go but i can't show up there until 10 o'clock so it is what it is you quit school but you still got some learning to do so anyway guys i just want to give you an update on what's going on uh, and uh you know of course i want to thank you for watching i wouldn't do this without you i miss you guys back home but you know it is what it is i want to do this and i want to work so uh thanks for watching i'll see my friends later